What's the matter? Mm. Don't you like the BLTs here at Kelly's? I do. I'm worried about Luke. I, I just wish that I knew where he was, that's all. Well, isn't that the whole point of him going on the open road? You know, he doesn't write, he doesn't call, nobody knows where he is, and then he just drops out of the sky, usually at the most inconvenient time. Yes, I know. That's usually his pattern. It's just that, to me, this time seems really different. Just by the way he was acting before he left, it wasn't like he was gearing up for one of his adventures. He seemed really troubled. Well, I tried to pry some information out of Tracy. I, I turned up the charm and everything, but <laughs> she is a tough nut to crack. Why are you even involved in this? For Lulu. He promised her that he would be here for the birth of the baby. Well, I, I didn't know that Maxie had already gone into labor. Oh, come on. In a few short weeks, she will. Well, then he's got plenty of time to turn up like a bad penny. <sighs> Why? 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 Laura, is it, is it really because of the promise that Luke made to, to Lulu, or is it... Do you still have feelings for Spencer? I can't believe that you are questioning me about my feelings for Luke. And I can't believe that you're not letting this go. I thought that you were okay with it. I mean, wasn't it you who offered to go try to get information out of Tracy for well, me? Well, I was just trying to be a good husband and go beyond the call of duty. Okay, so why are you so mad about it now? Because you're, you're letting Spencer take over your life, our life. Ah. <sighs> I'm, I'm running for district attorney again, and you're starting a business with Lucy. As far as I'm concerned, Spencer can drop dead, so I never have to talk about him again. Hello, Leslie. Goodbye, Leslie. Hello, son. Goodbye, son. What was that all about? Patrick, no. you're absolutely convinced. It's Luke who's sick, not Tracy. Yes, I am. And Scotty is so sick of hearing about it. I hadn't noticed. Mom, I know Luke. And he's like a wild animal. When something is really, really wrong, he just sort of crawls off by himself so that nobody can see him suffer. But he needs us badly. It, it just, it's heartbreaking. And I know Tracy knows something, and she won't talk. And I just can't come up with any other way to find out what's wrong. Leave it to me. I know what to do. Trace. What? What can you do? It may surprise you, my darling, but I was once a big deal at General Hospital. Oh, yes, I vaguely recall that you were one of the most brilliant doctors on staff. Trust me, I will find out what you need to know. Oh. Thank you so much. Thank I'm doing you. this for you. The same way you're doing it for Lulu. This is about your daughter, not about Luke. I may not be Scotty's biggest fan, but he is your husband. Don't forget that. I know, Mom. I do. Your mother's gone. Yeah, she is. I'm sorry we argued. So am I. I'm glad you're focusing on something other than Spencer. Excuse me, I need that computer. But I'm using it. But I'm Dr. Leslie Weber. Dr. Weber. Dr. Drake sang your praises during our intro tour. I didn't realize you still practice here. I'm consulting on a very important case, so if you don't mind. Oh, of course, the computer's all yours. Oh dear, oh dear, I've misplaced my temporary password. I'm still logged in, use mine. It was an honor meeting you. Good luck with your studies. Oh, do you think you're doing? 